things go on at the sports page. Oh, it's been busy like crazy over here. Now, at the beautiful downtown Mars Plains at 548 Spiegel Avenue. We had, oh, I, I'll tell you what happened. Oh, I got I to gotta widen this screen, I think. Hold on. I'm not seeing some of the names again. That's why. Oh, oh, that's not working either. Oh, watch out. I don't know. All of a sudden, I got a new thing here. All right. Well, maybe this will work. Maybe this will work. No, I don't want to mess around. But anyway, we got a lot of stuff going on. Yeah, oh, yeah. We had the uh, big pack war Saturday night. Guess who won? I don't know if he's here. Guess who won the pack war? Anybody here who won the pack war? Trading cards 13 won it. Trading cards 13 showed up and he won the whole pack war. Showcased over $500 worth of stuff. Unbelievable. Yep. And all kinds of stuff. We had some good cards pulled too. Uh, I think the best card, let me see. Probably the best card I thought was a Joe Flacco autograph. Somebody got a Joe Flacco autograph out of one of the packs. That was pretty good. A lot of stuff, though. A lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. You got a ball. You got the Bucky Dent ball. Yeah, you got a lot of stuff. There was over $500 of stuff in that case. I don't know how he did in the packs. There was a lot of packs, too. But we got all kinds of stuff going on tonight. We got our trivia tonight. Our 10, actually 11 questions. Because we're going to have another door question, too. And the winner later on is going to get a pick. He's going to get a pick between the Alfonso Seriano jersey card right there or the 1965 Bob Gibson card, World Series card right there. So our winner at the end of the night for our trivia is going to get a pick of that. We got 11 nice trivia questions. We got some sports news going on. We got acquisitions going on. We got some more sports page news going on. And I got a lot of packs hanging around here. So what I did to clean these up, we're going to be opening up some... Uh, 2009 threads. I got a four packs of that to open up. And 2009 absolute memorabilia packs. I got three of those to open up. That's the last of them. All the rest went in the pack war. Unbelievable. They cleaned us up. Unbelievable. But first, we're going to start off right here with the trivia. All right, so get ready. We're doing football first. Now, don't forget, fellas. Yep. Oh, oh yeah, he won a $50 gift certificate, too, in there. It was pretty good. Oh, yeah. Yep. But here we go. We're going to start off with football. Don't forget, fellas, if it's a player's name, I need the whole name. If it's a, a nickname of a team, I need the whole nickname, not just half. All right. Here we go. We have a Topps certified autographed issue of Marquee Hill. Somebody's going to win a Marquee Hill autograph card right there. Right there. All right. So get ready. Here we go with our question. Good luck to everybody. Yep. Number one. What state was the great Barry Sanders born in? That's all I want to know. What state was the great Barry Sanders born in? That's all I want to know, and I'm going to be looking for the answer. Let's see here. What state? What state was the great Barry Sanders born in? Oh, this is a, must be a hard one. Uh, oh, it's a must be. Kansas is correct. Kansas. Patrick 26 has got it first. Kansas. Patrick 26 has got it first. All right, Kansas. That took a while. You guys didn't know that one. See, I got I got some hard questions tonight. Oh, yeah, watch out. All right, so he's going to win the Marquee Hill. We'll put that up there and a ticket for the big box. Where's our big box? All right, we'll put that right in there. All right. Okay, so he's got the first one. Watch out. All right, we're going to go right away. Right away, we're going to start off with some mustache mojo. We're going to open the three packs of Absolute. I got to make sure the mustache hits all of them. I don't know. We'll see. And I'm still going. I don't know if you guys remember. 
I opened a lot of 2009 packs last year, and I get no Sanchez rookies. Nothing. I probably get one today, even just because he's probably not. I might not even play. Now I'll probably get one. But hey, if I get one, I get one. I can't complain. All right, let's see. Oh, right away, a jet. I got a Jericho Cotri. We should have kept him. I got a Antonio Bryant. I got a Tony Nomo. A Vernon Davis. And a Peyton Manning. All right, so, yeah, I got a couple guys there. On that one, we're going to go for pack two. Let's see here. I want something good this time. I got a Willis McGahee. Kevin Boss. Jamal Lewis. Wes Walker. And Josh Morgan. Wow. I'm not even getting an insert or nothing yet. Let's see here. We got one more of these absolutes. Oh, I got an Eli Manning out of the deal. That's not too bad. I got a Brady Quinn. San Antonio Holmes. Ooh. I got an Aaron Rodgers. And a Tom Brady. Eh. Even though it wasn't... I didn't get any inserts. But at least I got a few good cards there. What are you going to do? That's the way it goes. But later on, Shaq and Pat. Pat's here. He's way in the back. Way in the back. There he is. They're going to have the mojo too. All right, we're going to go to another trivia, so get ready. Number two on a night, and it's baseball. Yep. Here we go. Yeah, there's some balloons back there. Look at that. Somebody had a party. It's uh, basketball balloons. Look at that. I, that's almost by accident because they're supposed to actually be in the party room. But uh, we had Cub Scouts in there today, and they took my balloons and put them over there. I don't know. All right, here we go. Let's see. We got, for baseball, it's a Donruss Classic. Well, i got to read this. Legendary. These are, these are weird. It says Legendary Spike, but there's no spike on the card. But they're numbered. Number to 100. But there's no spike. It just says Legendary Spikes. I guess there's a picture. See, there's a picture of his spike. That's what it is, a picture. Yep. So somebody's going to win that nice Johnny Bench card. It's numbered out of 100. Here we go with our question. Yep. It's got, oh, this is not easy, fellas. Watch out. Yep. Number two. How many RBIs did Miguel Cabrera have in 2010? That's all I want to know. How many RBIs did Miguel Cabrera have in 2010? And I'm looking. I don't see it yet. 126 is correct. Giants 4421's got it. Giants 4421's got it. It's 126. 126 has got it. All right, Giants 4421's got that one. All right, so he gets the Johnny Bench and a ticket for the big box right there. All right. Oh, we're floating right along there. Oh, we got what we got? The, oh, you were going to guess 36. No. He had a lot of RBI. All right, the NFL draft is coming up. I don't know if everybody's excited. I'm pretty excited. I'm I'm looking for the Jets to get that Floyd from Notre Dame. I don't know what you guys are figuring, but the draft is coming up. Oh, yeah. Uh, Indianapolis, of course, they got to go for luck. I was thinking about that because, you know, I sit there and think sometimes. You know, once in a while I do think. My brain does work sometimes. And I'm thinking, boy, if they get that Andrew Luck, which they should, they'll have some great headlines. Here's some of the headlines I figured out already, fellas. The Colts win today. It's all luck. Ooh. Or Andrew's, or Andrew's luck wins out. Now, don't forget, fellas, you heard them here. These are original, original headlines from the sports page. Yep. So when, when those, uh, yeah, I like that all kinds of stuff. When those reporters put them in the paper or on TV, you know where they came first, right here. Oh, yeah. But uh, he's looking pretty good, eh? They got to start all over, I guess. So, hey, get luck. They might get lucky. Oh, all right. But the Jets better get somebody good. I don't know. They better get somebody good. They got to get uh, that Floyd, I think. 
because uh, I, I think sooner or later that San Antonio Holmes is going to be combustible, if you know what I mean. Also, more more of the football news. Deion Sanders. Anybody hear what happened to Deion Sanders? I don't know if he's going to be gone that floor. He might be still be there. Deion Sanders. Yeah, he got beat by his wife. Yeah. Supposedly she broke the door down. She must be an animal or something. She broke the door down, beat him up for all this kind of stuff. Yeah, and attacked him and all this, all this stuff. Yeah. Boy, I tell you, she must be a rough customer. Yeah. So uh, apparently they're getting divorced or something, so sh she's mad. So ooh, watch out. They should put a helmet and pads on her and let her go. Watch out. Yeah. Also, uh, the new big news or rumor or whatever, these guys make stuff up, I think. Tebow going to be a special team man. I don't know for sure, but I can't see that. There's no, I mean, he might fill in now and then, but uh, they're crazy if they do that on a regular basis. Nah, that, that, I don't think so. Nope. That guy, I tell you what, I think they're laying low. I think there's going to be a competition. Why not? Hey, guy went to the playoffs last year. He's not that bad. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. It's coming up pretty soon. All right, here we go. We're going to go with more trivia. We got the basketball going on. Basketball now, so get ready. What do we got here? We got a Panini season update All-Stars jersey of Joe Johnson. Joe Johnson jersey card right there from the All-Stars. Somebody's going to win that card. Yep. All right, here we go with our questions, so get ready. It's basketball. What college did Tim Duncan go to? That's all I want to know. What college did Tim Duncan go to? That's all I want to know. Wake Forest is correct. Raider Nation's got it first. Raider Nation 75. Raider Nation 75's got it. Yep. He's got it first. Raider Nation 75. i got to get that ticket. All right. He's got it. Yep. Raider Nation 75's got the Joe Johnson and a ticket for the big box. All right. We'll put it right in there. Yep. Okay, you got it. Oh, yeah, you got it. We're having a big sports trivia night. Somebody tonight is going to win a choice of the Alfonso Seriano jersey card or the 65 Bob Gibson World Series. Plus, we got sports news. We're opening the packs. We're doing all kinds of stuff. We got some acquisitions to show you. What do we got? Oh, acquisitions. Fellas, I know I keep rubbing my head every week. The stuff is coming in like crazy. It's unbelievable. In the back, there's almost no place to walk. It's nuts. Yep. But here's a few things that came in. We got some fighting stuff. Some fighting and basketball to show you first. Let's see. Oh, this guy looks mean. We got a Nate Diaz autograph. Nate Diaz autograph. I tell you what, this stuff is unbelievable. I put up uh, last week, well, every week we put about 25 of these nice fighting cards up on eBay auctions. And you know how eBay auctions are. Some things sell, some things don't. I only had four cards that didn't sell. So I sold 21 of the 25, fellas. That's not bad. No? Nope. Uh, oh, this guy is popular. I think they like him in Australia because it seems like every time I, se I sell him, I send him to Australia. I got an Arija Faber. What is it? It's an authentic fighter-worn gear thing. Yeah? Also, this guy. Oh, this guy's going crazy. I got a Michael Bisping autograph. Look at this guy. He's going crazy. And we got some basketball. What do we get for basketball? We got a Panini Preferred. Oh, that, I think that's the expensive stuff. Sam Perkins autograph, number 74. Sam Perkins. He was a pretty good old player. And we got a Feel the Game Kobe Bryant jersey. It's not bad. It's not easy to get a Kobe Bryant jersey. And this guy, I don't even know who this guy is. Luke Babbitt. Anybody know Luke Babbitt? Crown Royal Autograph, number to 25. Anybody, you heard of him? I don't even know who he is. Is he a rookie this year? Let's see. Nah, he played for the Trailblazers. I don't know. Now look at this guy here. I don't know who this guy is. There's no name on it, no nothing except... It says he's the professor. Anybody hear that guy? 
We're going to have some sports uh, football acquisitions later. I got some nice football came in. He's a street baller? Oh. The professor. That's was the best basketball card by far that came in, fellas. This is the 2010-2011 totally certified John Wall rookie jersey graded, autographed. John Wall, 8.5. Look at that. That's crazy. It's unbelievable. It comes. You know. Yeah, that's a big one. That's a good one. Oh, somebody's calling on the phone. Who's calling on the phone here? Let's see. Oh, I don't know. I got hold on, fellas. Wait a minute. It could be the NBA. They maybe they want that John Wall card. Hello, sports page of Mars playing. Tops tribute. We did have them and we sold out. Yep, now we have the Gypsy Queen. That's the newest thing out. Okay. They're all sold out. We basically get them in new. They sell out. We can't buy them for what we sold them for. Yep, but we do have the Gypsy Queen still in stock. That's the hottest, newest one. Gypsy Queen, it's uh, 24 packs in a box, 4 hits in a box. Yes. Uh, you know something? you got to call me back tomorrow. I'm actually closed right now and doing a blog TV show, so I, I can't go crazy answering a lot of questions. That's okay. Call me tomorrow, and I'll give you all the info. 10.30 to 6.00. Thank you. Bye now. Shopping on the phone, fellas. Shopping on the phone. I mean, that was nice. How many how many questions can you answer, though? Give me a break. All right. Let's see here. All right. What do we got here? We got... Oh, hello, trivia, fellas. So get ready. We're going to be doing some football. Football here. All right. What do we got? We got a football lot. Looks like Press Pass Legends. Ooh, oh, oh, wow. Wait, Raider Nation is going to see this one. Well, not this one. The next one. We got a Press Pass Legends Daryl Royal card in our lot. We got a Press Pass Legends Jack Tatum. Ooh, look at that one. We got a Press Pass Legends Roger Craig. There goes my screen. Uh, we got a Press Pass Legends Ozzy Newsom. And a Press Pass Legends Bob Lilly. Somebody's going to have a chance to win that stuff. And a chance for the big box. And here comes our question. Get them ready, fellas. Number four for the night. We got 11 for the night, so get ready. We're still early. What college did Reggie Wayne go to? That's all I want to know. What college did Reggie Wayne go to? And it's Miami. Dolphin fan in New Jersey's got it. Dolphin fan in New Jersey's got it. It's Miami. Well, you guys got that one quick. I thought I was going to stump you. I don't know why. That was a quick one. All right, so Dolphin Pan in New Jersey's got that one. All right, so we had four questions so far, fellas, and four different people have gotten it right. So nobody's got Monopoly yet. I'll tell you, it's a tough battle here. That's our fourth thing in the big box. All right, we're going to open a couple more packs, and we're going to do Shaq Mojo. We got Don Russ Threads from 2009 to open. A couple packs. Shaq, we're going to do Pepsi. Shaq Pepsi Mojo. We did the bull then last week. We didn't get too much. All right, let's see what we're going to get out of these couple packs of threads. Let's see. I did Mustache Mojo for the absolute. I didn't get too much. Hope we've got to get something here. What are we going to get? All right. We got a threads to Sean Jackson. We got a David Johnson rookie. Bit. We got a Derek Ward. Ali Evans and a Thomas Jones. What are you gonna do? All right, come on, Shaq. We got one more pack to go. Shaq said he was feeling lucky earlier too. I don't know. Let's see what we got. We got a Peyton Manning. We got a Kurt Warner. We got a Kyle Orton, and Shaq did it for us. Unbelievable. Shaq, you did good. Oh, yeah, Shaq did good. He's smiling back there. He got us a uh, rookie collection materials from 2009, this is. Michael Crabtree, Nate Davis. That's nice. 
jerseys. Shaq did good. Oh, yeah. He did okay. He did okay, Shaq. Yep. Congratulations. He did a, he got a Willie Parker for us. And he got a Greg Jennings. So, Shaq, you came through this week. Oh, yeah. But Pat's going to be next. Oh, yeah. Pat's not saying much. Pat put up that new uh, format uh, last week. And I have to agree, it did look a little creepy, so I, I eliminated it. I had to take it off for Pat there. Pat was a little disappointed. What are you going to do? But we still have the cow pen that he gave me. Oh, yeah. So you got to be happy, Pat. I'm still using your pen. Not bad. All right, we're going to go for question number five. And it's baseball, baseball now. So get ready. Here we go. Yep. You want blind? Oh, that. This, this is some pen, I'll tell you. All right. We have a... Oh, look at this prize. Well, folks, we got to get rid of them somehow. We got a Allen and Ginter Carlos de Bum Beltran back card. Carlos de Bum Beltran right there. Yep. There we go. Somebody's going to win that card. All right, here we go. Number five on the night. And it's baseball. In what year was the famous George Brett drafted in? That's all I want to know. What year was George Brett drafted in? And I'm looking. 1971 is correct. I got it. Who got that? 1971. I can't see it. Somebody with a long name, give it to me because it's a short name and it's cut off. Thanks. JGV123 has got it. Okay. Some of those short names, I'm not seeing them. I don't know why. I got to tell my guy over here. JGV123. He's got the Carlos the Bomb Beltran back card. Congratulations. And a chance for the big box. All right. JGV123. All right. Oh, fellas, this is five questions and five winners. But don't forget, you won the dogs. Whoever's the other dog tonight, we got our 11th question. And whoever wins a question on the first 10 is not eligible for a prize on the underdog. So even if you don't win anything on the first 10, the 11th question, you got a chance. All right. We got more acquisitions. We got some football acquisitions. There was like a lot of stuff. Fellas, let me tell you, it buried me. They, I, I, you know, I know they keep telling you every week. They, they bury me over here. I got a National Treasures. Well, this is a nice one. It's a rookie autograph of Jeremy Curley. Number to 99. Who hopefully will do good. Yep. I have a top Precision Austin Pettis autograph. Yep. Who's that? Sport card 99? I don't uh, buy, sell, or trade during the show. But if you want to message me, I'll see you tomorrow because I clean up after the show and go home because I get tired. But if you want to message me, I can answer you tomorrow. Uh, but during the show, I don't buy, sell, or trade nothing because I'm busy doing stuff. Sorry. All right. We got a National Treasures, oh, this is nice, NFL gear, Von Miller. Look at this, a three-piecer. A couple pieces of jersey and a football. Yep, numbered to what? 99. National Treasures, they're nice. Yep. Oh, speaking of uh, Neon Dion, here he is. Emblems of the Hall. Yep, nice jersey card number to 99. These are, these are nice. They got the Hall of Fame bust there and everything. I wonder if his wife was at the Hall of Fame when he got inducted. I don't know. We got the same type of card with Carl Eller from the Vikings. The Purple People Eaters. Yep. Oh, this is nice. It's a Emmett Smith NFL Greatest National Treasures. It looks like it's pretty much a patch. It's like an arm sleeve type of thing. Number to 49. Looks like the thing on his sleeve. Yeah, Emmett Smith. Can't go wrong with Emmett. We got a limited D'Angelo Williams autograph. Was a spotlight? I'm not sure what kind of autograph it is, but it's Numbered out of 25, so that's pretty low. The Angelo Williams. This glare is something over here. 
You guys see the firehouse across the street? There it is. I can show you the firehouse in the in the some some. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> Get some glare through that window. Oh, look at this. They keep getting pretty good. We got a plates and patches rookie autograph jersey of DeMarco Murray. Not bad. He should be back. All kinds of stuff. Toss Precision Kendall Hunter autograph. Oh, That's a nice big patch type of thing. Freshman fabric from Certified, uh, the Blaine Gabbert patch number to 25. Nice big piece of patch jersey. And this was nice. I, I like this card. I'm not too much on Jordan Todman, but boy, if this was a nice jet or something, I'd like it. But I like it anyway. It's an NFL gear, National Treasures Prime. It's got like two patches, a ball, and an autograph. Number to what? 25. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, he's eh. He, sell, he actually sells a little bit, but this card will sell just because of that. Yeah, he'll sell. But, and a lot of you new guys are wondering, where do I get these cards from? How do I get them from the sports page? Well, fellas, we have a fantastic site on eBay. Sports PG on eBay, where a lot of these cards will go in auction. Starting at 95 cents. That's right, fellas. You heard me right. They'll be starting at 95 cents. All our auctions start at 95 cents. Or we do have some really nice cards for sale on there. I think about 10,000 of them sitting there for sale at pretty low prices. Yep, we're pretty competitive with the prices, fellas. Also, some of the stuff's going to be at the sports page. That's our physical store you see in the background here at 548 Speedwell Avenue in beautiful downtown Mars Plains. Watch out. All right, we're going back to another trivia, so get ready. We got hockey next. Hockey's coming up. Hockey's coming up here. Our sixth question of the night. Let's see here. We've got a Mario Lemieux Game Breakers card. Mario Lemieux Game Breakers card. We're in New Jersey. We're in New Jersey. Beautiful New Jersey. Yep. Yeah. All right. Game Breakers right there. Mario Lemieux. Here we go with our question. Good luck, everybody. How many times did Dominic Hasek win the Vizina Trophy? That's all I want to know.